Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a Smackdown reaction. We are reacting to the Intercontinental Championship Fatal 4-Way with Sami Zayn, Apollo Crews, Big E and my dad, Kevin Owens. Or maybe my dad, probably not, but hey, uh, let's jump into it. Uh, uh, yeah, Fatal 4-Way, big match. There's not really much more to say about it. Let's just, let's just jump in. Links in the description. If you want to watch along with me, open up in a new tab. Unfortunately, I'm unable to show the footage because WWE are quite strict with their copyright. But if you want to watch along with me, links in the description. I'll count you down and we'll watch together. If you don't want to open a new tab and all that, which I totally understandable, I will be describing what's going on as it's going on anyway. So you should be able to know what's going on anyway, just from context clues. I'm rambling. Let's jump into it. You guys ready? Three, two, one, play. So Kevin Owens is down, Sammy Zane's beating him. Oh, punches. It's Kevin Owens wearing my shirt, or his shirt, I guess, you know. The same shirt is what I'm saying. Oh, Kevin's got him at the top. Oh, brain burst, brain burst, yeah. Well, Cole just said, Fisherman's Brain Buster for the top rope. Two. Apollo broke it up. And then Biggie's back in as well. Good move. Oh, Biggie. Spearing Apollo. Oh, Apollo reversed it. Kevin Owens on the apron. Stunner on the apron. Reversed. Oh. Some more drop on the... Uh, oh. Oh. F U A A A A. Oh, Spear. Biggie's hugging up. Oh, this is good. It's a spot fest. I love it. Angle slam reversed. Biggie, big ending. One, two. Ah. Oof. Commander is ease. Oh. This is good. This is good stuff. Oh. Oh, the lights got out. Fiend? Is that you? Oh. Undertaker. Boom. <laughs> Alistair. Oh. Oh, it's Alistair. It is Alistair. Alright. Uh, okay. Oh, Black Mass. Ooh. One, two, three. Fair enough. So Apollo Crews retained because of Alistair Black. So Alistair Black versus Big E. For some reason. Interesting. So Big E versus Alistair Black going forward. Interesting. That's not a bad set. That's not a bad rivalry, um, if, especially if he's building him up on the way to like a big title, a universal title match or something. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. What do you guys think? Do you think? Where do you think this is going? I assume this is leading up to a Big E versus Alistair Black title situation, uh, match situation. No title. I'm assuming Apollo Crews is going to move on to someone else in the IC title division, or they're just going to forget the IC title even exists and have no matches for it whatsoever going forward, which is also a possibility because it's WWE and they're useless at doing this. Um, yeah, um, it's interesting, interesting. So obviously, this is to kind of that's that's ended the Big E Apollo Crews storyline, I believe. So that means Big E's now being pushed away from the IC title, which I suppose is good. Uh, He's probably going to have a match with Apollo Crew uh, with 
as the Black at Hell in the Cell. Maybe not in Hell in the Cell, probably be just a singles match. Uh, and then Apollo Crews is going to move on to fighting someone else in the IC title. Or as I just said, they'll just ignore the IC title's even existence and then they'll just, just, he won't have any matches now for like a month or two months and then he'll just lose it randomly, which is what WWE like to do with the IC title. Hopefully, I'm being cynical. Maybe I'm not. Maybe, maybe he'll have a really good rivalry now going forward with Kevin Owens. That would be nice. Anyway, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. And until next time, too sweet. Later, guys.